Hello. Hello. First of all, have you met Huey? I didn't know we if you had met him. We just met. I was telling him my parents are huge fans of both of you guys. Yeah. So, well, they have but, great taste. Yeah, yeah, fantastic taste. My mom yeah. was sad she could not be here. She's uh, working. Make sure you rub it in. I will. Just <laughs> yeah. I'm going to take a ton of pictures. Don't worry. <laughs> it was such a party without you. Yeah. Um, <laughs> would you like some ice cream? I if, would. You, if you would, you can grab it anytime. Has anybody like ever turned down ice cream? Not me. No. I've talked to my friends about this. I feel like ice cream is like one of those things that everybody has a flavor that they like. Like, like it's pizza. the only thing that, exactly, like, like pizza. pizza. Nobody doesn't like it. So. Yeah, and if you don't, you're weird. Yeah, you're um, weird. But I wish I were you. <laughs> um, but I hear you just started driving. I did. You're 20, man. I'm 20, I'm, I was late to the train. So I got my license when I was, um, or to the car. I got my license when I was, <laughs> um, <laughs> I got my license when I was like 18 years old. I had to film this movie, and so I was forced to get my license so I could drive a pickup truck in one of these scenes. So, um, and then eventually I was just like, I was kind of scared to drive. I was like, I have Uber, I can get anywhere I need. Like, it's nicer to be like chauffeur, you know what I mean? <laughs> Fall asleep, I'm a busy man. Uh, I'm a busy But then um, eventually overcame the fear, and now I've been driving for four months. Still got it. Don't get your generation. Like, as soon as I could get a license, I was like, freedom! Yeah. It was it's, like Braveheart. It was like. I know. I, I mean, I feel now I feel the freedom, but like, yeah. I feel like the Ubers were just so convenient. I fall asleep. I'm like, who is going to kidnap me? I'm like. You are so trusting. Yeah. So many. Do you have you heard of Dateline? Yeah. Have you, like, I actually, my, my dad is a huge Dateline fan, so I used to I watch those all the time. I so. had to stop because I was terrified in my house all the time. <laughs> it's literally, I used to always watch it, and then I, my husband was just like, this is getting weird. Yeah. Like, I, yeah, I got really. Were you into cars growing up, both of y'all? Um, yes. My grandfather actually owns an auto body shop. I'm going to oh. plug him real quick A Action Auto. Hey! Um, there he is. But uh, yeah. you need some body work done. I can't promise he won't sell you a lemon, but um, <laughs> don't tell him I said that. But when I was younger, I used to work there, and he would pay me like $50 to work the entire summer. Um, so, the like, entire the summer? The entire summer. So child labor laws, people need to get on that. Somebody <laughs> come after him. But um, my sister would work the phones, and she would just get to sit in the office and like sit in air conditioning and just wait for the phone to ring. And she'd get paid hundred dollars for the whole summer. I was sweeping the yard, cleaning all of the cars. Like there was some inequity there. There was like <laughs> clear favorites. It was kind of reverse gender roles when it comes to the wages right there. <laughs> you were yeah. like, I'm speaking for the men. Yeah, exactly. Stand up. <laughs> Are you a big car guy? Uh, uh, well, actually, I live in Montana, so I'm. I'm more oh, of a horse guy. I uh -huh. love horses. That's amazing. That's all. You just brought the sexy cowboy in. I like it. It's a lot cooler. I, I know. My husband rides horse. I did. I liked riding horses until I bent my tailbone. And then I was like, you know what? I'm out. I'm not Annie Oakley. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. I was like, that hurts forever. Um, <laughs> yay. But you, you actually got your start in the business very young. Mm -hmm. So what was your first job other than sweeping your family's <laughs> <laughs> Oh boy, take me back. No, I'm joking. It was like 10 years ago, but um, uh -huh. I guess that is a while ago. I started acting when I was when I was 10 years old. Um, I booked a, sh a little show called Castle. Um, I heard that you're a fan. I'm a huge so fan, and I actually remember okay. this. Like, yeah, you were holding the picture. No. I know. Oh god. It was such no. a great show. Yeah, it was so good. But my my character's name. I had a one episode guest star role. Biggest. I was so proud of it. I ran in one of the characters. I was like, I ran oh, up yeah. to him. My name was Timmy. In the show, of course, a little kid named Timmy. Shocker. But, um, He's in the well. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> Timmy's in the well. But um, I ran up to him and I was like, Uncle Javi, you want to see my baseball cards? And, um, and that was your moment. Say, that was my big moment. So that was the break. <laughs> that was it. So you're. <laughs> First of all, you are hilarious. Uh, you are so fun. Thank you. <laughs> I mean, God, you're like a walking party. Um, so you're on Blackish. So who's the most surprising fan that you've met? The most surprising fan I've met? Huh. What about that? Okay, so let me start by saying this. We got to go to the White House for the Easter egg roll a couple years back. Okay, I, I know you guys can see where this is going. That's amazing. Um, it gets pretty good from here. Yeah. Uh, but um, we got to go to the White House for the Easter egg roll. Um, got to bring my entire family. Went to the went to the uh, Oval Office bathroom. They, their their um, paper <laughs> towels are literally like real towels. I love so that I was you taking went to the bathroom. Those. Yeah. The ba no, the bathroom was the coolest part. It was like marble all over the place. <laughs> 
I was like, whoa. This Most is how... people are like fascinated by the office. Yeah, no, but the bathroom was tight. Okay? <laughs> you spent a lot of time in the bathroom. But, um, yeah, we got to meet Michelle and Barack Obama. Um, it was an amazing experience. Yeah, there it is. If you, if you pay close attention, you can see my arm isn't around Michelle. Because I was like, is this illegal? Am I allowed to put my arm around Michelle Obama? Like, is Secret <laughs> Service just gonna like jump out of the roof and like, put your hands up? Yeah. So I was like, I think you chose wisely. I would have been did. nervous so too. So it's just awkwardly standing, you know, 14 year old Marcus just like, ah. So. <laughs> oh my gosh. Subscribe to my channel. Subscribe to my channel. Subscribe to my channel. Subscribe to my channel. Please don't make me keep going.